going to a different economy, and we're going to be learning more about that uh, as we go. But clearly, we're 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 learning that things can be done uh, from remote, remote locations. We're learning that technology can replace people even more than we thought. We're not going back to the same economy. We're going. We're recovering, but to a different economy, and it'll be one that is more leverage to technology, and I worry that that is going to make it even more difficult than it was for, for many workers. In Silicon Valley and my friends who work in technology know that what we did to the manufacturing workers, we are now going to do to the retail workers, the call center workers, the fast food workers, the truck drivers, and then even bookkeepers, accountants, uh, insurance agents, lawyers, and on and on through the economy. So what happened to the manufacturing workers is a very clear sign and so we'll import Chinese-based CBDC technology. So it's going to be CBDC in a box uh, provided to you by the People's Bank of China. Welcome, Welcome to the Crypto, crypto teacher. teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe if you do like what you're listening to. Please inform your friends and family and spread all over social media. It is imperative that we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works because once we understand how the world really works, we understand that it is all planned out. Now, I want to thank those who purchased the books, Crypto Teacher and the New World Order book. Remember, the New World Order book shows you how the world really works, and it is definitely time for you to wake up out of that sleep, especially in the times that we're in right now. Now, guys, I told you in 2023, in the first quarter, we would get an event, and now we have the banking collapse which the master magicians pulled off the perfect distraction. And at the end of the third quarter, going into the fourth quarter, guys, we're going to have another main event. Now, of course, the markets will still pump and dump until we get that next crisis. Guys, we know they're going to pull that rug. And all we have to do is watch the Fed to know exactly when that's about to happen. And also, guys, I want to thank those who purchased the three kids' books it's time to re-educate. Also, much love to those who donate to the Cash Shop Patreon. Much love. Keep it coming. Guys, if you're not a part of the Patreon, make sure you're donating to the channel through the actual Cash App. We all know this channel is shadow banned. Now, guys, in my Patreon, I keep you up to date with the New Road Order events. And then also, I give you the New Road Order cryptos. But of course, you have to do your own research. But guys, this next Bitcoin and crypto bull run is going to be a utility run. So you want to make sure you have the cryptos that have real utility. And much love to those who are shopping at both stores. Keep it coming. And of course, guys, we get into Bitcoin and cryptos first. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And guys, we saw Bitcoin and crypto get a pump early. And as I'm doing this video, Bitcoin and crypto was pulling back. But the only thing you had to do was look at the actual indicators. We saw yield rates dump early and now are starting to rise. And as we see, Bitcoin and crypto are pulling back. We know where the 2 and the 10-year was, guys. We're well off the highs, and we know that is great for Bitcoin, crypto, and tech stocks. And then also we have the dollar down, which is also great for the market. And then we have volume, tether, USDC. And then, of course, guys, we have the Fed. And, guys, we know the central banks are moving in lockstep, raising rates and running off the balance sheet in order to destroy this legacy market so therefore the fourth industrial revolution can rise and now we have the fed showing up liquidity make sure you watch the two videos yesterday i go over in detail but guys the 300 billion that the fed put back on the balance sheet helped pump bitcoin and crypto and guys we know if the fed is pumping money in we know the money is going to eventually make its way out it's not like we couldn't see the manipulation. We saw it in the stable coins. And we saw yield rates plummet. And then on top of it, the dollar is easing. And guys, that is always going to be great for the market. Now we have Jerome in the house this week. And we know for the next three days, the Fed is going to be the topic. And will they raise 25 basis points? I think they will raise 25 basis points 
We see how fast the Fed raised rates, and we also see inflation not going anywhere. We know the inflation that's in the market right now is corporate greed. And we know if someone's able to charge more for something, they're going to continue on doing it until the consumer stops buying. But never forget, guys, the Fed is fighting inflation that they cause. And they know when it comes to interest rates, it takes 12 to 18 months for them to hit the market. And don't forget, guys, these are men that are putting this plan out. Everything's not going to go to plan the way you want it. Even though they've ran plenty of scenarios, this is uncharted territory. Remember, they have to destroy this legacy market and bring in the fourth industrial revolution. Where the robots, algorithms, and drones take the economy over, pay each other with crypto, and the sheep are going inside the metaverse. Now, because we did get that recent pump, and then also the Fed is coming in bailing these banks out, of course, in the media, the reason why Bitcoin is pumping because banks are failing, but we know this is all scripted. But we're getting a lot of hype on social media. Bitcoin to all new highs in 2023. Bitcoin to a million dollars in 90 days. And we know in order for that to happen, they would be, have to be ready to flip the switch on the fourth industrial revolution. And we know we're not there yet. How we know? Because we don't hear the drums of beating. We do have G in Russia right now. But guys, we know this is a plan. Remember, they move in phases. But don't forget, guys, we do have the debt selling. And what helped us out pump also is Janet Yellen. Remember January 19th, she said we ran out of money. And that allowed her not to fund these Fed retirement accounts. And we know once the debt ceiling is approved, that's going to shrink a lot of liquidity out of the market. And Bitcoin, cryptos, and stocks are going to take a beating. And remember the crypto teacher told you. Now guys, next month, we know we do not have a Fed meeting but we do have quarterly futures ending on March 31st. So guys, I see a pullback at the end of the month, and then we start to move up at the beginning of April like clockwork. Now guys, don't forget about Grayscale sending about $22.8 billion. But getting over into a little crypto news, we have Crypto.com one step closer to a license in Dubai. And we have OKEX to cease operations in Canada by June 22nd of this year. And we see regulators coming down globally. Now we have UBS buys Credit Suisse for $3.2 billion as regulators look to shore up the global banking system. And guys, we know this is nothing but consolidation. All this is planned out. And we know in the fourth industrial revolution, the models change, guys. When it comes to all these derivatives, remember what Sam Bankman Free was working on. He was working on derivatives on blockchain ran by an algorithm. You no longer need people. And then on top of it, we're moving away from the fee based banks. Remember, tokenization in blockchain is going to cut the cost and speed up transactions. And then lastly, guys, we have Senator Cynthia Loomis says. Lack of laws are pushing industry overseas. And guys, how many times have I been over this? Remember, the emerging markets are leading us in a fourth industrial revolution on purpose. The United States is lacking behind because everybody is looking at the United States as it is now, the global power. That will no longer be. You're witnessing the fall of America to Babylon along with the United States world reserve currency. Bread and Woods 2.0 and Society 5.0 are right around the corner. We know the only thing we need is that one crisis to get us over. We know the politicians are not going to tell us the truth. They are paid puppets. But you know, on this channel, I give you the truth, nothing but the truth. Yes, the truth hurts, but it sets you free. Remember, guys, get in the lab because you do not want to get caught on the wrong side of history. And remember the crypto teacher told you because he knows when it comes to the new world order, it's all planned out. But that's all I have for you. Don't forget about the books. It's crypto teacher and the new world order book plus the three kids books. It's time to re-educate. Also, new to cryptos, Coinbase, BitChute, Binance, 
Do not forget book links and crypto links are in the description. The stock channel, guys. Don't forget to go like, subscribe, spread everywhere. You have your Kobo, your chip size, your banking, your gaming. While everybody's sitting at home, get on stocks, the receiver, the biotech stocks. And while everybody's at home wishing, they were still getting that free money. What are they doing? Drinking and smoking weed. Don't forget about those stocks and you have a wonderful day. The most powerful person in the world is the storyteller. The storyteller sets the vision, values, and agenda of an entire generation to come. Steve Jobs. And guys, you know I truly believe in this. When you look at the New World Order, they're the storytellers. And that's the reason why I wrote my New World Order book. But guys, now it's time to change the current generation. And I wrote three kids books. You know, I love the Trinity because I understand the power that's in it. So I have three books. We have an opportunity to change the generation, to educate, not just me, but I want to show you that I take action on a daily basis. And I want you to take action on a daily basis, whether it's your job, whether it's in your community. We have an opportunity right now to educate the masses. I posted this on my Twitter account. Please share. But this is a short clip of the three books. There's going to be a clothing line and action figure. Please get these books for your kids, nephews, cousins, friends. So therefore, we can start the re-education now. Because as we see, the fourth industrial revolution foundation is definitely here. Robots, algorithms, drones, taking humanity out the picture. We have to re-educate. But let's get into the video. Part 1. King Joshua and Grandma Tim. Save the village. Part 2. King Joshua and Grandma Tim. Save New York. Long COVID-33. Part 3. King Joshua and Grandma Tim. Goes to China. It's mandatory to get part one, part two, and part three of this series. It's time to re-educate Generation Z.